Hey, Geeks, Tim Tibbetts with MajorGeeks.com. Today we're going to show you how to change your system notification sounds. All those little beeps and melodies you're used to hearing. Nice way to tweak your computer. Press the Windows key plus S and begin typing in sounds and you should see change system sounds. If you don't, you can actually go start, control panel. It's a little buried in here. System, which is why I did the search. Sound. And when you find sound control panel, it'll pop up. All right, so here's a few things you can do. If you have any third-party themes installed, you probably don't. This is all this is good for here. No sounds in Windows default. What we want to do is come down here to program events. Now, there's a few categories. There's Windows. And if you scroll, you'll see File Explorer. And then you'll see Windows Speech Recognition. And if you have any third-party programs that support changing sounds through the sound control panel, they will be down here as well. Let's take asterisk. So what you can do here is you can click test and you don't like it. Windows has a lot of WAV files right here. So let's say critical stop. You might have to play with a few. Here's a Windows ding. And you could change it to be any sound that you like. So maybe notifications you're used to hearing more frequently, you can actually get something that sticks out. There you go. Now, next up, you can just hit OK when you're done, of course. Next up, we can hit Browse, and that will allow you to browse for a file if you wanted to change it. Now, what I've done already is I've already downloaded a WAV file, but just so you see, here is all the WAV files available that you just saw here. So what you want to do is search on the Internet for any kind of WAV file you want. There's tons of free WAV download sites out there. So I already did that. And I did that with the You Got Mail Wave right here. So what you want to do is expand your C drive and find the Windows folder, expand that, and find the Media folder. And then you can either left or just left click on this and drag it over, or right click if you want to copy it and save the wave for a backup. So if you right click, drag it over, let go, it gives you the choice. So I'm going to copy it there. Give it a second to copy over. Now, we can take this asterisk noise, which we played with so far, and click Browse, and that will once again open Windows Media. And since the letter starts with a Y, it'll probably be at the bottom alphabetical. There it is right there. Now, as you can see, you can only use WAV files. Click Open, and as you can see, you got mail, asterisk, ready? Th uh, throwback time. Woo -woo. And there you go. So that's a pretty neat way to really tweak your system a little bit just because we get used to beep, ding. And then some of these sounds are a little better than they used to be back in the day, obviously. But still, you, you start hearing that time and time again. And it's like that. Yeah. When user account control, we've all heard that. Yeah. So it's pretty neat. You can just change them around. And, you know, you can find some WAV files and really find something custom that you want. You can almost search for almost any combination of words with the word wave at the end and you'll be able to find them and drag and drop them as we showed you so there you go just a neat way to kind of make your computer your own and personalize a little bit without a lot of hassle so i hope you dug this video i hope you can click subscribe there should be a little uh major geeks icon appearing right down here you click on that and click like if you enjoyed the video thank you so much for watching and we will see you next time